I would like to briefly uh, introduce uh, our uh, graduate program. And uh, 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 my name is Wittong, and, uh, and I'm an associate professor and the graduate coordinator for the civil engineering program. Um, uh, I joined UTC uh, in 2013, and so it's time really flies. I, it's, 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 it's almost eight years. So this is just a draft of our, our program objective and outcomes. So uh, the objective of, of our graduate program is uh, to edu educate our graduate students to master essential techno technical knowledge in engineering analysis and design uh, uh, and develop real world problem solving skills. So we, we emphasize real world problem solving skills, not only just cover uh, the knowledge from the textbook and our, our students get involved in, uh, for example, a real world engineering problem like projects from TDOT, for example, and also pursue uh, advanced degree study and research in engineering to get our students ready for, uh, for example, graduate school. And actually many of our graduates uh, uh, after they graduate, they went, they go to uh, uh, graduate school for their PhD study. And finally, uh, engage in lifelong learning and professional development and professional licensure. And uh, both of our students, uh, they are going to get in their uh, professional engineer license after graduation. Uh, our team, uh, we are not a very big uh, department, uh, however, um, most of us are very active in research, like uh, uh, our department head, Dr. Winner. He is an expert in infrastructure and structural health monitoring and non-destructive testing. So that's his research. And Dr. Fulman is about, uh, is working in uh, intelligent transportation and transportation air pollution, air quality. And Dr. Dr. Younger. Uh, that's the one on the left, the bottom. Uh, she is an, a payment uh, lady, and her research is uh, in payment design and materials. Uh, on the right side, top, that's uh, our new faculty member, uh, Dr. Osman. His research is in intelligent transportation system. Uh, and uh, Dr. Jeja Basti, uh, he is working in uh, environmental and water resources. And me, uh, my research is uh, focused on intelligent structure and infrastructure and structural health monitoring. And this is a, a sample clear pass. Um, and uh, our program requires 30 credit hours for thesis uh, option, uh, which means if you choose to work on thesis, um, then you need uh, a total of 30 credit hours, which includes six credit thesis hours. And if you want to work on a project, then you need to take some extra courses. So the total required hours will be 33 uh, Hours. So basically, you may need to take uh, one or two more courses. Um, most of our students will graduate within two years, but a few of them grad actually graduated within one half a year. Um, so this is uh, one research area that our uh, uh, our department. Uh, so this is one research area. So it's urban water resources, and this is led by Dr. Jeja Basi. Um, I'm, I, frankly, I'm not really familiar with this research area, but this is this is the area that you may you may choose to work on. And intelligent transportation and smart city, and this is a very exciting area. Actually, uh, since our department is very small, so we decide to focus on infrastructure research. And one the area that we want to uh, really um, uh, 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 spend efforts is intelligent transportation. 
um, those are asthma, that's new factor member and Dr. Fulman and actually most of us uh, will be involved in this research. Uh, uh, intelligent transportation, transportation, for example, collected vehicle. So that's, that's one example of intelligent transportation. Um, and also, uh, um, we also work on intelligent uh, infrastructure and intelligent structure. And that's actually, uh, uh, for example, I'm, I'm currently working on using computer technology, that's AI, to uh, detect uh, permanent distress, also to uh, monitor uh, bridge health condition. Um, this is my last uh, slide. Um, these are three transportation research projects that our department is currently uh, working on. And these three projects are from Tennessee Transport, uh, Department of Transportation. And the first one is uh, a new payment design uh, methodology. And the second one is uh, so-called FDR, that's uh, a full depth recommend, uh, recommend, I'm sorry, FDR payments. Basically that's, uh, you want to recycle uh, the, uh, the payment and then use the recycled materials mixed with uh, binding material to, to you know, uh, to refresh or rebuild the payment. So by doing this, you can you can save uh, uh, materials and also labor, and it's good for the environment. And the last one is uh, uh, reading and inventory of T dot retaining walls and. This is basically through this project, we are going to build a, a retaining wall um, database for the TDOT. And also, we provide a method to rate the condition of the retaining wall throughout the state of Tennessee.